Hi, this is Dave Mast, your host for HomesCountyTicket.com. Welcome to Ticket TV, driven by Village Motors. Welcome to another exciting show. Today we have with us Jason Otto, head coach of the West Holmes Knights tennis team. Jason, welcome to the show. Thank you. All right, Jason, you guys are coming off of a season where you set uh, a, a pretty good number of, of high water marks for your, for your team. Uh, mostly, probably the, the best one was finishing third, I think, for the first time in, in OCC, OCC play. Yes. So uh, talk, first of all, just quickly, a recap of last year, and then we'll, we'll move on. So last year, give us a little hint as to uh, what, went hap what happened. Okay. Been for pretty fortunate. This is my 10th year. We've never had a losing record with the guys' tennis team. Uh, last year, we were close. We were 9-8. and eight. But that's coming off of seven varsity players, four of those being first-year players, and one only with one-year experience. So we were a very young team, uh, two and six to start the season, a lot of 3-2 losses. They had to learn how to win, and once they did that, they really stepped it up the second half. And, and to get that third place in the OCC, obviously uh, you've got a couple of teams in the OCC that are kind of head and shoulders. Tennis, they're really almost tennis schools. Lexington, yes. Yeah, yeah. yeah so everybody's always shooting for second or third because <laughs> Le Lexington's never lost the OCC. Yeah. So this year, you've got a solid core coming back. Tell us about uh, about who's coming back and what the uh, what the opportunities are that lie ahead. Okay. Yeah, six of our seven returning uh, lettermen. We only lost one senior, so pretty much our whole squad's coming back, and we probably have four or five guys fighting for that last spot. So we're pretty much the same team as last year with a little bit more experience. As far as the uh, – you've got Danny coming back. There's a state qualifier last year, Danny Nelson. Close, yeah. yeah. And, well, yeah. It just just missed. Yes. yes. And And – He's looking at uh, the next step, and, and I'm sure that's big on his mind right now because as a senior, Great. last chance, have you guys talked much about that? No, but, you know, I started thinking of my goals for the team and individuals, and I don't want to put the pressure on him, but he was one set away, yeah. one set away from state. So I think that should be a, an attainable goal for him to try to get to state. So he's playing one singles. Uh, who's going to be two and three then? I think uh, same as last year, Nate's going to be two. As of now, Jason will probably be three. Doubles. Probably Joey and Evan, and then second doubles might be the Meyer brothers, if Ethan makes varsity. Okay. And uh, big expectations, which is what a coach wants. I mean, you come into a season, you want your kids to expect a lot, don't right. you? Right, yes, yes. I always shoot for 10 wins. Last year with the young team, we were one short, and you know, this year I'm looking at possibly 12 or 13 wins. There's nothing quite like going to state tournament, is there? <laughs> no, it was, I mean, it's you, great. you had that with Rachel. Yes. And, and that was a joy for you, and, and I'm sure that you, uh, you and the kids are looking forward to giving your best shot to do that again this be, year. It would be nice to be down there with the guys, yeah. All right. Well, there's the upcoming tennis season for the West Holmes Knights, coached by Jason Otto. He's got some, some big expectations, and so do the kids, and uh, we'll be rooting them on this year. This has been Holmes County Ticket TV. Thanks for joining us. I'm Dave Mast.